the signs are clear. It is beginning to look a lot like All-Star Week in downtown Cleveland. Major League Baseball picked our city for its Midsummer Classic for the sixth time. The reason so many events keep coming back to Cleveland is not because we're a great city, which we are, but also because they leave feeling safe, secure, and successful. Roads are shut down, barricades are going up, and Cleveland police are beefing up their lineup with the help of local, state, and federal agencies. There will be hundreds of police officers downtown during All-Star Week. Some you will see, others you will not. We do the layered approach to security for events, so there are a lot of things that you won't even see. Of course, you'll see uniformed officers, you'll see security officers, uh, but there are a lot of things in buildings, on the street, all around town that you won't see. And then there are things that we do prior to an event to make sure it's secure, intelligence gathering, things like that, that people don't see. The eyes of the world will once again be focused on the CLE for a major sporting event. And with the big sporting events come those trying to make a fast buck and dupe you out of your hard-earned cash. MLB will be cracking down on counterfeit merchandise. We're working undercover with law enforcement officials throughout Cleveland, as well as on the federal level, to address the counterfeiting issue. Cleveland police will be on bikes, on foot, and in the air to make sure the hundreds of thousands of fans who come downtown for All-Star Week have an all-star time. In Cleveland, Tracy Carlos, News 5.